Hi Team Swag, how are you all? Let me make sure I'm in Team Swag real quick because for some reason, I'm not positive. Okay, I am. So I wanted to talk to you all, especially you new consultants, but also anybody that has not been working their business consistently that wants to pick it back up um, because that's the great thing about our business, right? We can literally choose to pick it right back up um, at any time. We can pick it back up where we started. We can pick it back up um, totally fresh. Like it's all up to you. We get so many fresh starts with our business. Um, every single day can be a fresh start with your business. It does not matter what you have done in the past. If you want to start strong right now, these three tips are good for you too. Um, I'm going to fill in the blanks a little bit later um, once I do the training um, and I want to hopefully reach all training types. So if you are a reader and you would rather learn that way, then I'll have the description updated for you. If you are a listener and you like to just listen to me talk um, while you're driving home from work, then you can learn that way as well. Um, so the top three things that you should do right now to start a strong business. Number one, set a date for your launch party. Okay, there is not a lot more important than this. You have got to have a launch party, whether that is a grand opening or a coming back party. You want to have a launch party. And actually, I have a launch party every single three months to introduce the new catalog. So this is something that you can do consistently in your business that will keep you active and keep you getting a consistent paycheck. 31 switched from the two catalogs a year method to the four catalogs a year method. Every quarter we get a new catalog for a reason. You need $200 to stay active every three months. And guess what? Every third month we're getting a new catalog. So even if you are just doing that um, seasonal party, you are going to stay active. So genius, right? Um, that is literally the bare minimum you could do and you could still get free product and you could still get a paycheck. So super exciting. Um, so you want to do a launch party. If you are a new consultant and you want that grand opening party, um, listen up. We need to set a date. Your party is going to consist of three days. So you're going to have um, pre-post day one, pre-post day two, and then that third day is your actual like big grand opening party. Um, and that is, it's essential for you to have a launch party. You're going to invite all of your friends, all of your family to your launch party to help you start your business strong. So they're going to order from your launch party. And then every single person that orders from your launch party, you're going to ask them to host their own party so that they can get their next order for free on you on 31 um, because they supported you in the start of your new business, right? That's how your business is going to keep going. That's how you're going to snowball. That's how you're going to meet new people. Every single person that orders from any party that you ever have, whether you know them or not, should be asked to host a party and getting their next order free for supporting that previous party. Um, it's it's just the way that it works. You're going to meet new people your way that way. Your circle's going to grow and you're going to have a strong, consistent, successful business. Okay? If you are coming back out of the gate, you can still start that same way. Send a message to your friends and family and let them know, hey, I'm having a relaunch party um, for my business. Do you want to come? It's really that easy. If you have not made your list of 62, um, those are your people that you're going to invite to your launch party, whether you're new or you're relaunching. Um, your launch party is also going to be great to see other people that may not have heard of 31 before. You're going to introduce them to 31. And if they don't buy, that's also another great opportunity for you to go to them and say, hey, um, I noticed you didn't get anything, but what were you liking? What did you like that you saw? And then guess what you're going to do? You're going to offer them a party so that they can that you can help them get that product for free. So it's all about the party and everybody wants to party because everybody wants to get their order for free. Um, and if they don't, that's fine. They can order from you, right? Uh, so both ways, set your launch party and then everybody that orders, you're going to offer them their next order for free by partying. And if they don't order, you're going to offer them their next order for free um, because they deserve an order for free, right? Um, whether that was because they didn't have the cash to buy from your launch party, um, whatever the reason is, you're going to offer every single person at your launch party 
to be your next hostess. Okay, so your launch party is your number one most important thing to set. Um, most of you all have given me a date. Most of you all new consultants have given me a date to do your launch party. So we are off to a great start. Um, so yeah, if you have not set a date for your launch party, do that right now. Look at your calendar. Um, I think that Sunday, Monday, and Thursdays are the best days to party online. So I like to focus on those days. Um, all right, let's move on to number two. The second best thing that you can do right now to start a strong business is create a VIP group. Um, that is going to be a closed group on Facebook. There are other variations that you could do. You can make a business page. Um, you can do like a Instagram, you can do all of those things, but it is very important to start with a closed group on Facebook. And you're gonna name it whatever you wanna name it, right? Whether that um, be Totes Adorbs with Whitney or Whitney's Totes Adorbs, obviously don't use that one, that's mine. Um, but you're gonna name it something super creative and fun that is kind of the start of your brand. Obviously 31 is a brand, but you wanna brand yourself as well um, so that your customers are like, okay, like she's a boss babe, like she's actually doing this. Um, so you want a closed group. In your closed group, monthly, you're going to share the customer specials. You're going to share any outlet sales. You're going to share the hostess special. Um, all of the sales you're going to share in your VIP group, your closed group on Facebook. Um, same thing. I just call it two different things. Sorry. And then you're also going to share any games, any fun ways to use 31. I always like to focus on the 80-20 rule in the VIP group. So 80% of your content should not be sales related. It's going to be games. It's going to be educational. It's going to be fun. Um, all of the sales or all of the non-sales posts should make up 80% of your content. So y'all got to think if you're only posting once a day in your VIP group, that means that most of your post each week are not going to have anything to do with selling 31. Now, whenever you get really good at it, like me and another, a few other girls on Team Swag, um, you're going to be able to plug in those non salesy 31 post with 31. So a lot of times you'll see us post a game and it might be how many M&Ms fit in this tote or something like that. Um, obviously that has nothing to do with the sale of 31, but it's fun. It's, it's, um, it's a game. It's entertainment on Facebook. Most of your friends on Facebook are not getting on Facebook to be sold to, to be sold to. They want fun. They want educational. They want entertainment. And we can provide that in our closed VIP groups. Um, so make sure that you are posting 80% non-sales post. Um, and again, if you're only posting once a, once a day, most of those sell, those posts are not going to be sales posts. So um, keep that in mind. Your VIP group, your closed group on Facebook, again, one and the same, is also going to be the spot that I have your launch party for you. I am going to do your launch party for you. Um, that is going to... Be the spot where you get your first sales and you book your first parties. And then you might get your first teammate there too. Um, and that is all going to happen in your closed group on Facebook. So make sure that you have that group. Um, that's where I'm going to have your party, okay? And then finally, the third thing that you should do right now to have a strong, successful business is set goals. What do you want to do monthly with 31? What do you want... 31 to provide for you each month. If you are in it for the sisterhood, then you're going to want to be engaged on Team Swag. You're going to be wanting to meet new girls at your parties. You're going to be um, engaging in your VIP group. That is going to give you what you want out of a sisterhood, um, meeting new women. If you want an extra $200 a month with 31, then you're going to want to make sure that you're partying at least once a month. Um, so just set those goals. What do you want out of 31? And then if you don't know how to get that, ask me. Ask me. I need $300 a month with 31. How can I get it? And I'm going to tell you exactly how you can get whatever you want out of 31. If that is all the free bags, I'm going to tell you how to get that, which is partying and making yourself your own hostess getting all of the incentives because they're always giving away a bag. There's always an incentive to earn a bag. Um, so 
anything that you want to do. Number three, the third thing that you want to do right now to have a successful business is make your goals. Um, and if you don't know how to reach your goals, tell me what your goals are and I'm going to help you reach them. All right. So just to recap real quick, number one is set a date for your launch party. You can even go into your virtual office on 31today.com and set up the party right there in your virtual office. And then you're kind of like, um, you're good to go. Like that's the first step to a launch party is making that launch party link so that people can shop, right? Step two, have that closed VIP group. That's where we're gonna have your launch party and that's where you're gonna continue to grow your business online by sharing the specials, sharing all of the fun that 31 has to offer and all of the other good things that just make you you and your own brand. And then three is setting some goals. And again, if you don't know how to reach those goals, ask me, I'm gonna help you. That's what I'm here for. Okay, if y'all have any questions, please let me know. Hopefully this was helpful for you new consultants or anybody that wants to just reboot their business. All right, talk to y'all later. Bye.